you will need a bottle and about a cup of water and a cup of oil, both in the bottle. You may also wish to colour the water um, so it looks a little bit more like the sea. Uh, so either food colouring or paint is fine for that. So to make the waves you need it all in the bottle and make sure the lid is on very tightly and turn it on its side to move it gently from side to side to make the waves. So as you can see the oil is sat on top of the water. This is because oil is less dense than water which means that the molecules which make it up are all sat slightly further apart than the molecules which make up water, which are sat very close together. The waves are made because I am putting energy into this bottle. If I just hold it still, the waves disappear. This is like in the sea, and the wind comes along and pushes the water to make it into waves. And think about when you go to the seaside and you can see waves, especially on a really windy day and the waves are huge. And then it's not just the little bit of the sea that you can see, it stretches for miles and miles. Think about the amount of energy the wind has to be putting into the water for that to happen. And that's happening even when you don't see it. And God put all of that energy there to begin with. Isn't that amazing?